Hi guys, charity shop gold or garbage? Been having pretty lean pickings lately. Haven't found very much interesting at all. And all we've got in the bag today is some books. I have mentioned in some of my previous charity shop videos that I'm collecting these Beast Quest books for my grandson because he quite likes reading them. So I managed to find some more in this session. They're all ones we haven't got already. I don't know how many's in the series now. There's at least Let's have a look. It goes up to 42 in this one. But I know that I've actually got 50 something already. So, it's quite a lot to collect. But because I only buy them in charity shops. So, um, I don't pay the full price. In fact, I got these at a special deal. They were marked at a pound each. But I bought ten for six pounds. Just having a quick look, see if I can see what number they go up to. That one only goes up to thirty six, the other went up to forty something, didn't it? So I know I've got numbers up to 50 something already. Yeah, that goes up to 54. Normally £4.99 each, and the bumper special editions £5.99. Is that 2012? That was dated, so they're quite old. And then the other thing I've got in here. more of those Beast Quest books. Like most young men, well, possibly young ladies as well, but I can only speak from the experience that I've got grandsons. He loves dinosaurs. And I saw this one. pound fifty in the charity shop. I just thought it's wonderful. As you open each page, you're dissecting the dinosaur. So I hope he likes it. I reckon it's brilliant. Especially at that price. £14.99 originally. So there we go, a load of books. No radio controlled cars, no other toys. And that was Dorothy House in Cainsham.